everybody. Dr. D here from Explore Holistic, and today I'm going to talk about the temporomandibular joint, or TMJ for short. And I'm sure you heard the term, but it is actually those jaw joints that when you open widely, you feel them in front of your ears. Well, sometimes you hear a click or a pop, and today I'm going to talk about why that happens and what you can do about it. So let's get started. Before we begin, let me just clear the record. Most people are confused about what TMJ actually is. TMJ stands for temporomandibular joint, a part of the body, but is frequently thought of as a problem people have, like I have TMJ, which is actually a condition. Some of these conditions could include pain, clicking, can't open widely enough, sometimes you get headaches, but in reality, you actually have two TMJs, a right one and a left one, and they're very delicate joints. They depend on each other to work properly, and they're the only joints in the body that do that. Think about when you open your mouth. Both joints on either side of your jaw move together, and everything needs to be in balance. When they aren't, well, problems. So what's actually going on inside? What causes the clicking? In short, it's the effect of an imbalance, which may be caused by stress, missing teeth, maybe misaligned teeth, uh, maybe poor dental work. Think of the TMJ as a ball and socket joint, like your upper arm into your shoulder. The lower jaw has what can be considered the ball, and the skull has a depression that resembles a socket. In between that ball and socket is a disc that's made up of cartilage that allows the joint to work smoothly. That disc, specifically when it moves while you have an imbalance in your mouth, is what creates the click. When you clench your teeth, for example, that lower jaw really gets jammed into the socket. It compresses the disc, forces it to move. That movement, each time it moves, will create that sound of a click or a pop. So let's talk about what you can do to help with that annoying clicking. First thing, you may be grinding your teeth at night, and that is primarily due to stress. Try reducing that sugar before bedtime and having a nice herbal tea uh, to calm your nerves. Definitely stop watching TV before bedtime. Uh, you'll be definitely much less anxious. Maybe you're clenching your teeth during the day, usually due to stress. Uh, so try taking some time for yourself. Uh, do some deep breathing exercises, try some meditation. Do things to get your mind off of stressful thoughts. What if you're just beginning to hear some clicking? Well, the best advice would be to go to the drugstore, get one of those over-the-counter night guards to wear at night uh, for protection. This may be helpful in reducing or removing the click itself. If your click was helped with the temporary night guard, you may want to ask your dentist to make you a more permanent one, one that is tailored to your specific bite, which may make it much more comfortable. So if your clicking does not go away, or may even get worse, you need to consult with your dentist about constructing perhaps a more advanced appliance, or discuss with him other options that can address your specific needs. So there you have it. I hope you found it valuable to learn about TMJ clicking and what you can do about it. Take a look at our other videos about how oral health affects general overall wellness. Thank you for watching like us and hit that subscribe button and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.